see some improvement from their young core. I'm quite interested in former first overall pick Markel Fultz. Now we know about his struggles. Defended by Green. Drops in the layup for two. Offensively, we need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. He has disappeared this quarter, not making a mark at all with his offense. You know he'll be happy. You know what? They need some more help. Luka Doncic on the wing. It's deflected. And it's out of bounds to the Mavericks. Guarded by Williams. The rim rattler. Lead by four. Impressive total. Skill set from Luka Doncic. The defense having trouble containing him tonight. And they pick up two. Doncic missing. From outside the arc. Nailed from three point land. Guarded by Doncic. And it's good. Two points. You're now tuned in to Old Head TV. Put some pressure on that like and that subscribe button. And don't forget to turn those notifications on. Hey, yo, what it is, YouTube world? It's Old Head TV. And I'm back in the building. Back in the builder. And I'm back with another banger for my 2K family. First and foremost, I would like to apologize for the lack of uploads on the channel. My laptop was freezing and my programs is crashing. And I literally spent the past two weeks trying to fix it because I wasn't pressed to come out the pocket to have somebody else fix it for me and I'm glad I didn't because I fixed it and it's running like new and I have a lot of catching up to do but before we get started please put some pressure on that like button it's free it costs nothing to support and if you aren't subscribed just take one second and hit that subscribe button I have a lot of NBA 2k24 content coming and I don't want you to miss out but today I have a do-it-all point guard build six foot eight floor general that could dominate the game in every way possible from finishing at the basket back to the basket face up spacing the floor playmaking rebounding and protecting the rim now on the defensive end this build is a cheat code on the strength of you are at the point guard position standing at six foot eight with a seven foot six wingspan and that's a nightmare for smaller guards on the defensive end as well the offensive side especially on a 3v3 and 2v2 this build is a paint masher so for the shooting hand right left doesn't matter the jersey number doesn't matter but i went with number 32 because we're gonna go full magic johnson on this build best point guard ever if you feel otherwise let me know in the comments who you think is the best point guard of all time and why all right now let's get into the custom template for the position of course it's going to be point guard the height is going to be six foot eight the weight 290 19 pounds wingspan is going to be seven foot six now let's get into the attributes okay first we're going to start with the physicals so the stamina is going to be a 98 vertical is going to be a 60 and 60 vertical gets a bad rap but you will be able to rebound with a 60 vertical also do know that this year rebounding is more about positioning unlike the previous 2ks okay for the strength you can max that to an 84 and that's going to give you some silver bulldozer immovable enforcer and silver brick wall for the acceleration that's going to be a 74 and the speed is going to be a 82 now let's get into the finishing okay so for the close shot you're going to take that to a 84 and that's going to unlock hall of fame pro touch gold paint masher and silver fast twitch okay for the driving layup you're going to take that to a 91 and we get a crazy arsenal of finishing badges hall of fame acrobat Two step, float game, scooper, gold bunny, fearless finisher, gold slithery, and all the layup packages you can stand. Everything is unlocked. And for the post control, you're gonna take that to a 92, and that's gonna give you Hall of Fame post spin technician, gold hook specialist, drop step, 
Reaper, Dream Shake, Silver Back Down Punisher. But most importantly, we unlock Gold Unpluckable, a very vital badge to have at your disposal if you plan on running the point guard position effectively. All right, for the shooting, your mid range is going to be a low 63, but it's very possible to green your shots in the mid range on a 63 midi. You do have the badges to give you a boost like Silver Space Creator, Post Fade Phenom, and Guard Up. For the three point shooting, you're going to max that to a 78. That's more than enough to green consistently from three, pending your jump shot, your timing, and if you have your high zones, which is very important when it comes to being a consistent shooter. And as you can see, we get nothing but silver badges. Most important, catch and shoot, claymore, corner specialist, and we get bronze dead eye and Asian three. But this is not the focal point of this build. This is what I would call a luxury to have on a build like this. And also, you're going to put your free throw to a 73. Now let's get into the playmaking. Now for the playmaking, you're going to take that pass accuracy to a 92. For me, the playmaking is the focal point of a build like this because you have the ability to make your teammates better with badges like silver bailout, gold relay passer, touch passer, and for the tougher passes in traffic, gold needle threader, also hall of fame post playmaker and break starter. For the ball handle, we're going to take that to a 85. And the speed with ball, you can max that out at a 77. And as you can see, we get everything we're going to need to make this build move with the ball. Hall of Fame physical handles will come in handy with a taller build like this because smaller builds do tend to crowd your space, especially in the backcourt. We also get gold ankle breaker, silver blow by, speed booster, handles for days, and bronze killer combos. Everything you need to drop your defender because if you got the stick skills and they're up to par, it's nothing to break your defender in 2K24. Now for the defense, interior defense, you're going to take that to a 70. Perimeter defense is going to be at 85. So you're going to be able to lock in with silver clamps, challenger, fast feet, ankle braces, and the steal is going to be a 45. And that's not enough to rip the person you're defending. But this year, you're going to have to sacrifice something. And honestly, I would sacrifice still over any other category when it comes to this build. For the block, that's going to be an 80. Now, I didn't intend for this build to be a rim protector. I just feel that at 6'8", six 7'6", six wingspan, you should be able to protect the rim at some level. And for your offensive rebound, that's going to be a 73. And the defensive rebound is going to be an 83, giving you silver rebound chaser and box out beast. So now we're going to hit the finish button so we can see that final product. And there you have it, Shades of Magic Johnson, Devin Booker, Shea Gilgis Alexander, and this build comes out as a diamond inside out threat. So now we gonna test the build, get it to 99, see how it's moving, and that's it for me, Old Head TV. Be sure to put some pressure on that like, that subscribe button, drop a comment, let me know what you think of the build, and what builds you might want to see on the channel in the future, and I'll be sure to get to it. Until next time, Tom P. I see a catalyst for that. Yeah, that could get him going. I think so. We've seen those kind of plays get them going in the past. He gets that one. Pass to Suggs. Carter. And it's Wendell Carter with the jam. Many turnovers. Yeah, at the point guard position, so much runs through. You have to be aggressive, but also disciplined. Guarded by Doncic. By Carter. Pass to Wagner. Soft touch off the glass. For that pick. Doncic with it. It's it. And they're pushing it up. Here's Carter. Nice pass. Led him to the rack. Perfect. The three is up. Williams. And it's the magic on the break. And it's Isaac. He pulls up the Houdini act to then catch it and slam it through. Stupendous alley -oop. This crowd stunned. You can see his confidence. Everything he's putting up in long range seems to be falling. Drills the three pointer. There's a screen. Down low. And he jams it in after taking a nice feed on the run. Guarded by Doncic. 20 feet out. And there's another one for the match. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Curry comes.
covering. Got it. Good job in the low post. To the paint. Job good by Anthony. That's a good job of spotting his teammate near the bucket and firing the pass in there. 